Hello mates, my name is Risk and welcome to something that I didn't think gonna happen. Welcome to House of Velez, the full game, also known as part 2. So uh, before we even get into this, this video was brought to you by my Patreons. I want to personally thank Jonathan, Scrap Bits, Empress of Shadows, uh, Mark, and also I would like to thank Chronosu for pledging while I was editing this video. <laughs> okay, back at risk. Blinker and Moon Knight for supporting me on Patreon. And if you guys would like to join them with the support as well, uh, you can check out my Patreon page, which there is a card info on the top right corner of the screen. Just check it out. There is still a special offer. You can still get a personal shout out if uh, if you still join, it's it's still going only for one more week, so if you're interested in that. And any support that I get is appreciated, so check out the Patreon page. Again, card info, top right corner. And yeah, um, I'm. it's one of these videos that you think you're ready, but you're not actually ready. All I gotta do to reach this game now is just hit the continue button and look for the last save data, which was end of part one. Oh no, I'll see you on the flip side. <laughs> this can't be it. No. God, those stitches. Okay. Okay, come on, think. I'm gonna need something. Not ideal. I hope that'll hold. At least for now. I'm not going to end up like him. I'm going to get out of this. You go, Lily. Part two, sins of father. Whoa, 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 why am I running? There you go, you don't want to run. So, just a reminder uh, how the game works. I hold left trigger, to press triangle or Y, and then I press B or circle, and then I place, press the right trigger and stay in this white spot area. If I don't stay in this spot, uh, the white spot area, you can see that I emit some sort of light that light is presence, so I let my presence known if I'm not in that white area. And yes, it is kind of hard to stay in there. And uh, yeah, there was a bit of technical difficulties. Uh, this is actually like two hours after I actually said hello mates. But now it all works, uh, everything is good now, so we can actually finally play the game. Farther down. Already know what's back that way. I'm not sure it's a good idea to go even more down. Oh, I thought it was a slide. It's actually just a set of stairs. Sorry, it's the child in me that wants to slide all the way down. So yeah. Um, by the way, if you haven't watched uh, part one of House of Velez, I left a link in the description. Uh, so you can check it out. It's uh, pretty creepy. And if you haven't watched that, you missed a lot. And this game is known for being 
brutal and gory. So if you're sensitive to anything graphical, I suggest you click away from the video now. If you're still here, it means you're you're with the big boys now. And it only gets more brutal from here. So I don't know if this video is gonna be even monetized. Hint, support me on Patreon, hint. <laughs> Most of my videos do get monetized though, so don't worry about it. There is a bunch of eyes on the wall, nothing too creepy. Is there anybody behind me? I can't look behind. Sounds like something is boiling. <laughs> I, f I feel watched, I don't know why. Nah, it's probably me being paranoid. Is that a baby's head? Oh my, it is. Feels like home. Huh. Don't worry, this is just a warm welcome. Uh oh. Lily, are you still with us? What the fuck? No swearing. I'm just kidding. She's allowed to swear. She's a big girl. Sacrifice is to suffer. Huh. What is, what is he holding? He's holding a brain and a heart. A statue of a str strange being holding a heart and a brain in either of his hands. The writing on the wall behind it reads, To sacrifice is to suffer. Alright, so... Yeah, my daddy's gone. I think, uh... Yeah, the, the, I think the Lily statue took him. And killed him. Pretty sure of that. Uh, I guess I'm just gonna skip that. I'm not gonna pick up any of these. More in focus mode. Well, well, in focus mode, Lily can sense the locations of hazards and hidden traps in the environment. Okay, got it. So, is this focus mode? I guess so. Oh, jeez. I wonder how it looked like if I die by these things. But let's not test it out. Yeah, actually, maybe I should. That's the only way I get a thumbnail. Ooh! Welcome home, Lily. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, we didn't save. I have to watch everything all over again. No. I want to look how it looks like from the top. Oh, never mind. I, okay, I'm not sure what I was expecting. I was expecting something similar when it went, you know, when it goes up, it kind of cut off and you could see the eye. But when it went down, it was way worse. Okay, this time, no more dying. Unless it looks really cool. Actually, this one does it way fast. I wonder if it has a different animation. Oh, it does! Oh. Yeah, this game has a lot of different animations for each one of the death scenes. And we, like, found three already, and this is just the beginning area. Imagine what it, it it looks like when you encounter an entity of some sort. I don't think each... Oh no! What happened? <gasps> that is also a different animation. Are you telling me each one of these pillars has a different animation? I'm not sitting there, it's too much time, but... But I guess if you want to explore it yourself, you can play it? Yeah, this is very similar with like RPG horror games Where you like, uh, there is a lot of ways for the characters to die Okay, I got past it I got past it Where is it? Go! Okay <laughs> The light thing uh, over there is kind of playing tricks on me But it's good, we got past this level 
question. Why do we need a machine like that? What is that? What is that? Hello? There's something alive in this bag. There's a note nailed to it. It reads, I give my body. So can I have your heart and your brain, please? There's something alive in this bag. It reads, I give my eyes. What does the third one say? I give my family. Huh. There's a bunch of doors around here. This door is locked. There doesn't appear to be any sort of locking mechanism on it, though. There's an engraving on the door. The suffering of the past sustains us. Let us bask in their eternal agony and know that beyond this gate, yours will be tenfold. Uh, the door in the middle is open and this door is open. I'm not really sure what these all statements are about. Oh, that room doesn't look pleasant at all. I'm not exactly, I'm not really able to hear what he's saying. What did I do? Journal of Victor Velez added. Victor Velez is like my dad, isn't he? I can't exactly read it. The past weeks have been fueled with paranoia and things I could never have imagined. The house is empty. My wife and daughter have long since left me alone here. Our maid seemingly left without notice. I am the only one here. Yet I hear my wife's voice calling me from our bedroom. I hear my daughter crying from her room upstairs. The mirrors reflect images of people who are not there. I have taken to leaving the television on to down, uh, drown out the voices and have painted over the eye every mirror in the house. Nearly broke my damn hand in a fit of terror in the bedroom the other day. Insects crawl from the eyes of family photos. I have taken each and every one down to the den and burned them all. Sometimes I cannot leave the house and the phones do not uh, connect. Even when I'm able to live, I know I am being followed. No matter where I go, I am followed. I have made a decision to put the father's theory to the test. Where he failed, I must succeed. At least I end up like him. Tonight I will leave the artifact on this... Uh, skewards doorstep. Timothy has been unhealthy obsession with the occult, and he will surely be consumed by it. I pray this is the only time I have to resort to such measures. Huh. Well, he's dead. Doesn't doesn't really matter. What is this head in the middle? There is a panel here. Uh, cursor move. Oh, this is like the first time you use the cursor in this game. I, I only use the analog. Or at least that it only lets me. What happened if I put the wrong code? There you go. Oh god. It's a reminder that I forgot to save again. If we look quickly at the save files, you'll see that I'm all the way back to Hall of Sacrifice. Okay, let's check the middle door. I have no clue what the code could be. Oh, there's a face in there. I better not get too close to that thing. Its eyes are soon shut, but I know it can see me. Okay, I can't, I really can't. Sit in the wheelchair? Sure. What is that? What is he saying? Bird with eyes? The bird with the red eyes, that's what I heard. Oh god. Okay, there's the bird. That does not look like a bird. Oh! What happened? What happened? Oh my gosh. Well, she's still breathing. She's good. Right? Oh, that's a nice haircut.
So you only get a few tries? I did not know that. God damn, the game is so brutal. Okay, I'm back to Hall 2. <laughs> I don't know why you guys look shocked. I thought you guys are a bit tougher. The bird with the red eyes, I got it. Let's let's try it. Um okay let, let me try this. There you go. Got it? Did I get it? I got it. Oh I I can see it. I can see. I can see. I can I swear for a second you could see actually like hands coming from behind me. Maybe that was my timer. I did not pay attention to that. It isn't moving anymore. I think it's dead. In any case, I'll be keeping my distance. Sure. So is that it? So there is nothing more to do with this. Well, I have no clue what I did. I'll leave. What did I just do? Wait, the third door is also open. I did not know that. Uh, I recognize this voice. It's that baby again. Okay. What's on TV? No, I should have saved! I should have saved! No, go back! Go back, go back. Leave this area! Leave, leave, leave! I gotta save! If I don't save, then all this is for nothing. Sure, don't worry, we're gonna see whatever happens when I mess with the TV. But first of all, saving is of the most, most importance. Let's try and play with the TV. So, I can turn knob clockwise and counterclockwise. Four? All found dead at the grizzly scene last night. All missing their heads and arms and strung up by chains in their living room. Paramedics on the scene said it looked as if they were individually closed, like mannequins on a display. More on the story at 11. 11. Tragic strikes a quiet suburban home this weekend. 4 11? A family of four. A family babysitter were all found dead. Uh, I'm currently on 11, aren't I? All missing their heads and arms and strung up by chains in their litter. Wait. On the scene said it Move hand clockwise. Move hand counterclockwise. Change selection. Oh. Display. Okay. More on the story at 11. Tragedy strikes at uh, suburban home. Change. There you go. These bodies are from the news story. They can't be really here, though. It feels like something is messing with my mind. 45-50? Okay. 45-50, 12, and 5, and 20. Right? Did I? I hope I got it. I would look so cool if I got it in the first try. Uh, first of all, we're saving the game, though. You guys gotta remember every after every single thing in this game, you save the game. There you go. Now back in there. Forty-five, fifty, twelve, five, twenty. Let's see. So, forty-five, fifty. 12 and 20 oh 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 no back back I say <laughs> oh god no not again I'm not watching this oh oh I'm supposed to figure out what the age they have uh, on the clock here what happened if I get it wrong uh oh. 
Oh, that's a big baby. But why? Oh my god! This game does not take it lightly when you screw up a puzzle. By the way, if you want to see more of this game, let's shoot for somewhere around 200 likes. If we reach anywhere around that, I'll play more. Sure, I'll do that. Okay, okay, at least I remember. So, uh... The mom... Or... Okay, the husband is 50. Oh, I got it, I got it. So the small hands are hours. And the 45 is minutes, right? So... Yeah, yeah, I got it. 30, 45... 50... Uh, 50? Uh, 50? Okay, and uh, this hand is uh, 20, so... Uh, 10, 20. Got it. I got it. Come on. There is no way this is wrong. It doesn't let me confirm it. What's going on? I can't confirm the puzzle. I can't do it. It doesn't let me do it. Hold up. Maybe if I leave the room and come back, it will let me do the puzzle? Because it's not letting me... It's not letting me put anything. Okay. So... 5... 20... 12... Yeah, I got it. Come on. Yeah, I, I, I can't do this. It doesn't let me. Okay, so for now, we're gonna ignore this room. I don't know if it's bugged or anything, but I just cannot put the hands combination that I put. Uh, only when it shows up and I instantly confirm it, then I get, like, the death scene. But other than that, I can't really get any reaction from that. So, uh, I think after you move the hands for a while, it just kind of doesn't let you interact with it anymore. Or confirm it, like confirm the combination. There is a code here. Oh. 0135678. Wait. But how do I know the right combination? Maybe they're uh, in a different way? Oh. The liver is always the first. Limbs are last. So it's six, eight, five, three, seven, one, zero, six, eight, five, five, three, seven, one, zero. I got it. Y'all good, man? Think I help him out. I'm totally saving after this. <laughs> Remember, every, after every single one, you just have to save. Okay. So I got two out of three, but the third one... Oh, I got the document. But the third one, I don't know if it's uh, bugged, because I told you, like, I can't... I can't confirm the hands. Uh, I, I just can't. Yeah, I need to do the third one, but I can't. I'm not sure what to do about this then. Hey, so it's been about two hours since last time that you saw me in this room. Uh, I finally figured out how to do it. Apparently the developer says it's uh, a rare glitch that I have and he can't replicate it. 
but it's okay because I found a way forward. It just doesn't seem, it seems like a different combination was the, the answer for me for some reason. I don't know. I, I really don't know. So this is what I've done. Um, the mom hand obviously on 45, the dad's hand on 50. Um, the thing is, even if I get a combination wrong, oh wait, hold up, camera settings. Even if I get a combination wrong, uh, I, sh I, I should die, so at least something should trigger. So, uh, this is not really a fault on my part, this is definitely something weird in play here. Uh, the girl hand is on 12, and then the boy hand, uh, supposed to be on 5, and the... Oh, no. And the babysitter's hand is on 20, and then when I press, nothing happens. Something should happen, but nothing happens. So what happened is I took the small boy's hand, and I put it over the uh, the girl's hand, and, and then I tried. Oh, it doesn't work. Well, why did it work last time? I don't understand. How did I do it last time? It de I definitely got through that section last time. Okay, let me try this. This is one of my new save files that I, I had to go back to the original game and try and create a new save file for this game. Uh... And let's see if it works. Like, how did I do it? Okay, so... I put this here. And then I put this over 12. And then... Again, everything... Like I told you, Dad is on 45. Mom on 50. Wait, no. Uh, Dad is on, on 45. Mom is on 50. Uh, woman there. Child there. And then the other child is over there. There you go. Why is it not working? Why did it work now? It's a different combination than the last one! What? Screw me, man. I'm not asking any questions. So it seems like something with the save file had something to do with this. Because it only worked when I went to the one of the original save files. So let me delete one of the uh, these save files. Yeah, so there you go. What the hell, dude? That is so weird. That was not the right combination. And yes, uh, I have to do these rooms again. So uh, please excuse me. I got all three bodies. I released the one with the family, the one with the, the torment and the one with the eyes. I don't know. I don't know what they were. The door is still appears to be locked? Oh, okay, the door unlocked. Cool. Oh, jeez. Christ's sake. What else could possibly happen? Somebody was there. I'm not alone in here. Okay, Lily. You can do this. Just move slowly and focus. Uh, what is it? Who made that sound? What? She found me? Who are you? How did she do that? What the hell? How did she find me? I was quiet. Maybe she wants me to walk slowly. Because that's what she said. I, I thought it's something about the heartbeat, keeping it low. Because usually that's how enemies detect you. They they sense your presence, but... Okay, I guess I'll try and walk slowly. If I press the B button, I should be able to walk slowly. Here. Okay, Lily. You can do this. Just move slowly and focus. Oh, she has a big radius, doesn't she? Oh, she's coming back. That's great. No. That's absolutely great. Okay, so it seems like she has a traps too. Gotta pay attention to those. Oh, God. Okay, there's another trap right there. I'll wait for her to come back. Uh, uh, 
Oh, she's coming back. Well, I think I got it this time. She's gonna yell, right? Yeah. I got it, guys. I got it. I think I got it. Press the elevator button. Oh no, I, get, I need to get away from the elevator! I just noticed there is a trap underneath the elevator! God damn it! Oh! Oh! Come on, dude! I finally made it to the other side! God damn! This game is not... This game does not like me. Okay. Come on, come on! No! God damn this game! I'm sorry, guys. It's been like five hours since I started this uh, recording session and I had... Had to stop recording and then start recording again and then stop again and this keeps happening. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, I got it this time. Got it this time. Do I have to press the button again? Okay, this is why I, stay, I steered clear from that uh, path. So is the ele elevator here? Come on! Oh! I'm so fucking good at this game! She's coming back. Oh my god, did you see that dodge? I mean, that was actually pure luck, but still. Oh my god. <laughs> this is such an irritating section. I'm gonna have nightmares about this. Okay, she's gonna scream on one more time and then I go towards the elevator and try and pry it open. Got it. Come on, come on! Got it! Got it! I got it! Oh, come on. Oh, I have to keep it in the center. Well, this is easy. Oh! I will totally die there, but the thing is, I'm not gonna do this again. So I'm not dying. If you guys want to see it for yourself, then maybe I'll do it when... Uh, maybe I do an old death video for this game. Jesus Christ. Where am I? Great. I made it to the Halloween castle. <sighs> what is this? The sugar tunnel? Part 3. The Art of Suffering. Ah. Oh. oh, there is more parts then? Because uh, in the beginning we played part 1 and this was part 2. Now we reached part 3, which I didn't even know what the, was a thin. I would like to give a big thank you to my Patreons. Thank you so much for supporting my videos. Uh, it makes stuff like this a bit easier to go through. Knowing that you guys kind of back me up. Because I'm probably not going to get ads on this, let's be honest. But uh, yeah, thank you for supporting my videos. If you guys want to see your name among them as well, you can actually check out my Patreon page. There is a, a lot of cool rewards and also we still have the special offer going on for another week. So please check it out, uh, card info on the top right corner of the screen. And see if there's maybe anything or any reward you'd like. I'd appreciate it. So thank you for watching, thank you to my Patreons, and uh, Thank you for the developer for also giving me a free copy of the game. Uh, which, by the way, there is a link in the description if you want to uh, buy the game for yourself. So, 
if you dare <laughs> click that link. I'll see you guys in the next time. Bye-bye. Stay, stay safe.